Hi, my loves. Welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Vera Anom Nachi. Please go ahead and click on that subscribe button and be part of this amazing family. Over here, we teach you how to slay on a budget. And to all my supporters in the house, God bless you all. Please enjoy this beautiful video. Hi, guys. So in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to use this Brazilian wood to achieve this beautiful hairstyle. Yeah, so I'll go ahead and cut into the length that I want to use. And then this is what the length looks like. I'll go ahead and then I'll comb this hair thoroughly. After combing, I'll use the flexi rods and then I'll roll. Rolling The rolling method we're going to be using today is the twist and turn method. Okay, so you twist the hair and around the Keller, don't just turn the hair around you twist okay and then you turn it around yeah keep on watching okay guys after the rolling method the next thing is a hot water process get a bowl or a bucket whatever you have and then you put it inside and then i'm going to be using this conditioner to apply on it the reason is so that the hair will become extremely soft and bouncy the next step is the hot water process make sure it soaks into the hot water okay guys after the hot water process i covered up with the towel for a few minutes like three minutes and then i took it out and then i had to flip over the hair so that the ones that didn't soak in the hot towel soak properly and then guys you know that this flex rose was made with foam it was floating so all the water went down the hair came up so you have to be sure that everything soaks deep into the hot water i went on ahead to cover it again for like two minutes and then i took it out again and then i took it out of the hot water this time okay so after taking it out of the hot water you allow it to dry for some time yeah before you can unravel the curls so when it got dried i had to take out the curls okay to see how it looks keep on watching okay guys see how beautiful and bouncy this curls is make sure you apply any conditioner that you have during the hot water process that way the hair stays moisturized beautiful and bouncy keep on watching okay my loves it's now time for our installation process i'll go ahead and divide this hair into a different section like the way i want the hair to look okay so i'm going to be dividing this part of the hair like i'll take three parts i'll divide three parts but each part as i cut it i'll make sure i cut it nicely and then i'll comb after combing i'll go ahead and use a rubber band the small rubber band to secure it that's what i'm going to do at this part keep on watching okay guys so when i finished i went straight on to use a rubber band to hold it at the back okay i'm going to be holding it at the back when i finished holding this part at the back i also come and hold this other part okay at the back and then i'll secure with a rubber band So after securing with the rubber band, I'm going to be using this wig cap, this net wig cap on my hair because we're not going to be having any cornrows done. Okay, this is a swift and really easy method to do just in case you don't know how to cornrow your own hairs. Just use the net to cover up your hair and then you do your crochet. Yeah, because this is a crochet method. So I'm going to wear this net, okay, and then adjust it really well. Yeah, keep on watching. 
okay guys so i'm gonna be pulling one end of this hair pull it very well make sure it's loose then move over to the next end and then pull it and make sure it's loose the reason is so that when you are splitting it'll be very easy for you to split because if you don't do that and you start splitting it will get it might get tangled or it will get tangled at the end there so this is what you should have when you split so split only into two parts when you get the hair so this was what i actually got after the splitting so i'll allow you watch and enjoy the crochet method okay enjoy it all you want i'll come back later and then i'll keep i'll explain further but guys you see the rubber bands that i used to hold the hair down there i later on took them all out so that i could actually feel free because i felt like it was really tight on me and it was hurting i was feeling pain so i had to just take it out and then i continued my crochet without holding it with the rubber bands keep on watching okay guys so i'm gonna be leaving a little spiritual tip here for you okay you know some of us we attract very bad spirits it could be a man when you have when you make love to a woman some of the women have bad spirits in them and then you invite those spirits into your life and into your home if you're a woman and you sleep with a man some of them have bad spirits and you also invite such such spirits into your home so once in a while it's better for you to cleanse your home you never know every evil spirit or any evil eye that's on you you really have to get rid of it what do you do you have to get a cinnamon powder okay get a cinnamon powder make sure that every corner of your house is clean clean your house very well mop your house the the walls every like everywhere the windows make sure everything is clean then get the cinnamon powder and then sprinkle at every corner of your house at your window side your door everywhere okay and then leave it there what it does is that it's it it, it chases every it chases evil spirits every evil energy that is found around you it takes it all away and then it attracts good energies and then it brings you wealth cinnamon brings wealth into people's homes so just in case you do not know you have to do this and the second one i will ask you to do is to get a cinnamon stick boil it make sure you boil it very well let the water let the water evaporate inside your house every part of your house okay that way you also get rid of bad energy and it will attract money to you and then pour the rest the water in front of your door okay that way you are attracting very good things into your life okay so i had this on my life on my live session last time my live stream last time but then it was taken down cause of one or two issues I'll, I'll come back on live and teach us a lot about these things that will really help us attract wealth and good energies into our lives but for the meantime i would always say it here when i'm recording videos so yeah go ahead and do it and ask me any question about that in the comment section down below keep on watching okay guys so when i got to this point i had to cut off the net yes you have to cut it off i know some of you will be like what is she doing is she gonna leave that net there hell no so i'm gonna cut off the net and then i'll take out the lines of the net yeah the banded areas there i'm just gonna cut it all out okay and then after cutting it all out we'll continue with our crochet yes baby keep on watching
okay guys after the crochet i'm gonna be using this nature canada hair wax to lay down my edges okay keep on watching okay guys after laying down the edges the next step is to go ahead and trim off the tips the excess the ones that we don't want go ahead and trim it and give it a very beautiful shape but be careful when you are trimming so you don't over trim this hair keep on watching okay my loves my makeup is beautifully ready i'm gonna be using this hair oil to moisturize our hair remember that we used um a conditioner when we're soaking in hot water so this hair is already really soft and so nice it feels like human hair so this oil will give it more moisture and make it look beautiful and attractive keep on watching Ooh la la your girl is ready i rocked this hair oh my goodness y'all know your girl now i rocked my makeup i rocked my hair i slid it look at this hair so beautiful but then i was not okay with that one i wanted to style it a different way i went ahead to apply edge control around this part of this hair okay i had to give it really really nice designs laid it nicely okay so guys you see the reason i use the hair net the hair net is a protective style yeah and it's also quick and easy to do for those of you who can curl your own hair and then it helps you style your hair anyhow you like because it's versatile so look at imagine me restyling this hair in a different way yeah so after laying down my edges beautifully and really nicely i went straight on to use a scarf i have this scarf that looks almost like my top color yeah this scarf i'm gonna use it to scarf the hair like i'm gonna scarf it simple and neatly and nicely <laughs> your girl didn't come to play now y'all already know y'all 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 <laughs> Please, I'm not an American, no. I'm just talking how I talk. So, y'all know how we do it out here, yeah. So, if you're hearing me say, y'all, y'all, don't get angry at me and start feeling like, what is she feeling like? Please, oh, your girl is only playing, oh. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Oh, my God. This hair came all the way through for me. I hope you all enjoyed this hair. Let me know what you think about this hair in the comment section below. I'll see you in my next. I love you all. Bye.